Hey everybody, it's Camille and I'm back with another video. I just wanted to give you guys an update on what's been going on um, during my two week wait. So um, basically, um, I had my transfer done last Friday. So it's been five days since my transfer. Um, I've still been experiencing some cramping, um, breast tenderness. Um, I mean, that's pretty much it maybe a couple of mood swings i'm not sure my husband's been telling me i've been a little grumpy lately but hey i don't see it <laughs> but anyways um i decided to do a pregnancy test just for the heck of it no reason <laughs> well there is a reason but you know i understand why it's so hard <clears throat> and what everybody's been talking about how hard it is during the two-week wait but i just decided to do one and i got a faint positive um, but that's just something to keep me going and keep me motivated. I'm scheduled to get my blood work done, not this coming Thursday, but next Thursday, no, next Wednesday, the 25th or no, the 26th, the day after Christmas. So that will be a great Christmas present if it comes back that I'm positive and I'll be really excited. And then I'll take another one that Friday, they wanted to see the numbers get higher or double or whatever, depending on if I'm pregnant with just one or multiples. We'll just see from there. But whatever the case is, I want those numbers to go up. So <clears throat> Thursday, when I get my blood work done, they said they wanted to be at at least 25 or higher. So encouragement, guys, prayers, send all that this way because I really want to have a baby. We really want to have a baby. But I mean, that's pretty much it and what's been going on i've just been relaxing i have an in-home daycare so you know i've been limiting my picking up the babies and up and down the stairs and so i just try to make everything more easier on me and my body right now until i get through this two-week process um i've been going crazy because i play sports i bowling i play bowling and i'm in a bowling league and i um I'm in a volleyball league, and the fact that I haven't been able to play since the week before my um, monitoring started, oh my God, it's been so, it's hard for me not to be able to play, but at least I get to play in a couple weeks, because Christmas break, so that knocks down that, but I'm happy I get to play. Um, I will be doing a video soon on... Things that I think people should be, people, wives, couples, men, women, whatever. I just think that people need to be aware of um, going into the IVF process, during the IVF process, and even after the IVF process. Because um, I had someone uh, mention that kind of below. And so I'm like, that's a good idea. I should do that because I started to just write everything at the, in the bottom of the comment. But I said, no, I'm just going to make a video. So, but other than that, I've just been relaxing and chilling at home and not doing too much. Just finished Christmas shopping yesterday. Oh, also, another thing about this <clears throat> cramping, I guess when you walk too much, it'll you can start to feel pressure and more cramping where you just need to sit down and don't move. So I understand why they're saying limit all that. Yes, you got to find out the hard way. But yeah, even though I take a time and all, it still was a little pain. So I don't do too much walking and lifting and all that. But anyways, I've been doing good. Just wanted to check in with you guys and give you an update on what's been going on. Um, so yeah, till next time, hopefully soon, make this video. Matter of fact, I'm going to talk to you guys Wednesday. And I'll have, hopefully I'll have the video then. So yeah, I'll give you guys an update Wednesday when I have my blood work pregnancy test and... Wish me luck and send prayers, guys. And I'm sending lots of prayers and love out to you guys. that's trying to have babies also. And I just wish everybody could be successful in this. But that's the chance that we take. But anyways, bye, guys. Until next time.